Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Diz and I make Call of Duty videos every single day without foul on the latest news, the latest leaks and just everything Call of Duty. So if you like that sort of stuff, be sure to hit the subscribe button. We're nearly at 2,100 subscribers and you've been smashing it recently with it. So first of all, we've had the new Season 2 Battle Pass trailer for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War and basically Warzone, if you get what I mean, because it's on there. But we've had some exciting stuff in this trailer, hell of a lot of stuff. More skins, more bundles, and most importantly, what everyone's been waiting for is we're getting Samantha Maxes on the second week of the bundle, and also the bundle, I mean the battle pass, and also the reactive camos, and we're going to go over them. So basically, there's three weapons here. So as you can see here, it shows a blueprint from uh, Call of Duty Cold War, and it's called the Vulture Exo, and it's got the glowing sort of arrows next to the name, and it's the Assault Rifle Golf, and... Basically, every time you get a kill, the reactive blueprint changes and it is stages on it and it's got the kills on here at the bottom, uh, 50, 100, 150 and 200. You can also swap it to zombies, which is pretty cool. And then the next one of the blueprint picture has three arrows and it's obviously the same model, but the camo looks different. It has more of like a glowing effect. And like I said, this one shows the zombies one now and says three, six, nine and 12. Uh, that's the blueprint stages. Obviously, I'm still not sure. Maybe it's like rounds. I'm not 100% sure on that one. Maybe you guys know more about it. But then we do also have another camo on here. And then this one shows it again, but it shows the reactive blueprint stages on multiplayer. And it's more of a gold camo, which is shining and then a bit of green. I don't know if that's the final one off the blueprint of the reactive camo. So that's all we've seen at the moment. But what do you guys do you think about it? I take it we're going to get a hell of a lot more of the reactive camos coming out. And yeah, there's a hell of a lot more bundles coming out. And if you do like bundle videos, I make them all the time. Latest leaks of bundles, bundles, every single one I go over them. And a lot of you seem to enjoy them. So if you do like that sort of stuff, be sure to hit the subscribe button. So the description of the reactive camos or reactive blueprints is it says, Reactive property lets operators display their skill in real time by evolving their weapons appearance with kills during a match. I take it, the more kills you get, the different the camo and people can see that if you get what I mean. So yeah, just quite a cool new thing coming to season two. We've also had Modern Warzone mention that Samantha Max's operator bundle will not be in the battle pass, which I said in the beginning of the video. It's two weeks in the battle pass and instead cost 1,400 COD points. Not too sure if that's a typo or not because 1,400 is not bad at all for a very big operator which everyone wants so yeah we shall see so tier 100 of the season 2 battle pass also unlocks this warlord skin for the new naga operator and the poison dart blueprint for the new lc10 smg we also have three free war pack track packs are coming to black ops cold war as tier 44 black ops 2 mixtape tier 72 rock pack 2 and tier 94 pop pack and we have the renegade elder skin uh, of tier 20 elder of meant adler so yeah that's about it anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you like this sort of stuff i upload as quick as i can for you on all the latest news leaks and bundles and yeah hit the like button subscribe and tell me what you think about the camo and i will get back to you Peace.